What's going on YouTube? It's K-Dogs Kendall Kendall coming at you with more of my Shining Force walkthrough. And we are in for a battle this time around. We are in the circus tent. Um, up here I uh, looted these two chests. Uh, I did a little bit of level grinding. This chest here, you get 50 coins. And in this chest, uh, you get a steel arrow, which is ideal for Hans. So that way he can um, be a little bit more effective in battle. But, uh, but yeah, let's get started. We got uh, mannequins, evil puppets to deal with. And one of them, I feel like one of them can uh, poison you. I, th I always thought the zombies poisoned you. The, the zombies do not poison you. Um, the, um, the zombies just do a lot of damage. Bam! But you, you have to come into this fight with some preparation. Uh, because if not, you're going to get absolutely wasted. Got giant bats, which... Nothing new, nothing, oh my god. But... The evil puppets, mannequins, all this stuff has to go ASAP. And then we'll talk a little bit more about the marionette as we get closer. Come on, Wart. Good job. Take him out. And when Hans is able to attack, you will see... Um, that that's... He'll do some more damage. He'll do more than one or two hit points now. Because he's got that upgrade. That uh, steel arrow. The bats are eventually going to make their way over here, so I'm going to try to get to them before they get to me. Oh, of course he's going to go after K-Dog, because he's the leader. Not bad. Not bad. Three hit points, I can handle that. It's a good day at the office. The dire clowns usually do not move their position whatsoever. The I'm gonna go this way. This are fucking worthless. Tao's got her power staff. Oh my god, Tao! Well, she takes down the mannequin with a double shot. Beautifully done. Yeah, the marionette will not move at all. I, I, I will promise you that. The marionette will not move. Now we can kind of make our way up here. Uh, the enemies up there will start to uh, slowly move their way down here. Yeah, thank you. Oh. Double attack and puts her to sleep. Thanks a lot, dude. Appreciate that. Take him down, Luke. Or completely whiff and miss. Thank you. I'm oh, sorry, the clowns will move by the, uh... Um... By the, um... Marionette. Okay, seriously. I'm, I'm over the missing, guys. Seriously. I'm over it. Uh-oh. Evil Puppet has magic? I didn't realize that. Freeze level one. Ooh. Did a little bit more damage than I wanted to see. Okay, one damage. I can handle it. May's got some very, very, very good defense. Got to admit that. I don't think any of these things have been damaged. Please. Okay. Better than what anybody else has done. Um, let's go... Good job, Lo. Good, good shot there. Chris wakes up. Well, I'm so happy for Chris. 
me to kind of come over here and help Low. I don't want Low being by himself over here. Take down this evil puppet. Now, Hans, keep in mind, has the steel arrow. And now he can do not up to nine, you know, well. Hans goes to level seven, which got him nothing, but that's alright. We'll take it, my friends. We'll take it. Yeah, these evil puppets you want to get rid of ASAP. get overrun by them, they will completely mess you up. One point of damage, I can, I can, I can handle that. I can easily handle that. I need you. Oh, and one thing to uh, to mention, one thing of note to mention, I should say, um, if your leader in that Gort uh, or Gong, I'm gonna freaking about to put you on the bench. But if any of your um, your main character uh, gets killed, you go back to the priest. You have to restart the battle, and you also lose 50% of your gold. There we go. Takes out the mannequin. Good job, Bort. Now we should get rid of these dang freaking pesky bats and we'll be in business. If Luke and Gong can hit anything. Okay, I stand corrected. Luke, you know, just maybe got a little hot under the collar there. Open Henry would take him out, but that's all right. But there's not many enemies, but the enemies that are here are, are lethal. Absolutely lethal. Bam! Low taking out the bat. Very nice. Good job, Low. Griffin's gonna move you up here just because there's really no use for you. Notice the marionette has a lot, and I mean a lot of range. not a good thing. Actually, this wasn't a good thing either. Never mind. K-Dog just wiped it out in one hit. Level 9. Maximum hit points increased by 1. Very nice. Alright. So all that is left is the Dire Clowns and the Marionette. So let's talk a little bit about the Marionette. The Marionette is uh, the boss. You take out the Marionette, the fight ends. Uh, she has 35 hit points and... and um, Oh, the question mark, it's well over 100. Uh, the problem with the marionette is the marionette is under a constant region effect. Now, those that have not, are not familiar with the Final Fantasy series, uh, regen is a... Uh, it, the marionette will basically generate hit points every turn. Um, so if you... You know, somebody hits her and it takes five off, she'll have that five off, or that five health back on her next turn because every turn she gets she has a, uh, like I said, that uh, constant uh, region effect region effect, whatever it's, whatever you want to call it going to be a little risky here Ken's got the most health, uh, HP at 24 Ken goes to 8 attack by 2 uh, health points by 3, very nice I really don't know why I didn't have uh, Gong heal K Dog, but. And Marionette loves to use the Freeze 3 spell. Mm. Marionette might take Ken out, honestly. Unless I can, no. Nice. 
over there were here because Wow, the marionette did not chose not to uh, attack or uh, do her magic, which is very weird. There we go. One of the dire clowns is done. Leery about what I want to do here. Let's attack the clown. Okay, I'm all right with that. Ken healed. Move him down here. I said everything about this game is strategy based. Right, that low heal. Ken. points of damage, but uh, she uses uh, Freeze 3, Gort's going to be gone. <clears throat> Again, not sure why Marionette's not attacking, or not using her Freeze spell, but because it's got range, but... Alright. So clowns are gone. Not enough to get her. Not, her, not enough to reach her, I should say. Notice how I'm spacing everybody out. That way, not one person doesn't get hit with, uh... Alright, we're gonna come over here with Gort. See what kind of damage we can do on her. Okay, seven, that's not bad. That's not bad. I'm going to actually use you. Okay, nice. Six points of damage. That's not bad. Chris, just stay down here. You're absolutely worthless. Alright, now she's just going to do a physical attack to Gord. Hmm. Use that power ring. Oh wait, hold on. Use power ring. We can use it on any of these guys. Use it on Ken. Ken's offense increases by 15. That will eventually wear off, mind you. That's Blaze. See, notice how Marionette's getting getting health back. See, that's that constant region effect that we were I was talking about. May, you're gonna go over here because you're not gonna do much damage to him. Fucking unbelievable. Hans can't hit it with an arrow. Alright, kid. Use your power ring. Oh my god. 20 points of damage on the marionette. Unbelievable. Gort, finish her off. Oh my god. Finish her off, Gort. And we freaking fracking got her. There we go. Woo! Marionette is defeated. Trust me, guys, that is a very difficult fight. Goes to level 8, defense by 1. Fools, light will never defeat the darkness. She, that evil woman, was going to take me to Runefoss and feed me to a dragon.
Thank you. I'm going home and I'm never leaving. <laughs> Probably for the best, buddy. So while we are here, um, let's finish looting these chests. But yeah, like I said, very tough fight, guys. Don't don't think for a single second uh, that that's a that's an easy fight because it's not not by a long shot. Kadar discovers a defense potion. Let's use it. This is my two. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. I don't think there's any other... Anything over here? I don't recall. No, there's not. There, well, there is. There's just an empty chest, but yeah. No. The marionette, like I said, I, that, I recommend the power ring on a, uh, a stronger melee character, because, uh, yeah, that... I will say that is the first time I have ever defeated the marionette in the, my first try. It's my fault. I should have noticed he was in there too long. Thank you, K-Dog. Oh, you're welcome. You're a dick. So now we go to the mayor. Thank you so much, K-Dog. Take my ship. It's all yours now. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. I wonder, I'm gonna try something. Will Arthur join up on the force now? I can't remember when you get him, but... try. I want to fight again. I can help you against Rune Vost. I'm coming with you. So there we go. Arthur joins the Shining Horse. I'll be at headquarters. Call me when you're ready to go into battle. Well, that's fantastic. Alright, so our next destination... Talk to the mayor again. Actually, I have a uh, guide looking at this guy because I don't remember. I think I have to go up here. When you reach Man Arena, see uh, uh, Ot Ramp. There's, there's nothing he doesn't know. I doubt that, but that's okay. I don't want to see it. See your gay ass play. I don't think we lost anybody. Okay, cool. Nope. 
Maybe I gotta try to get on the ship. Major ship is yours. This ship will do just fine. Let's gather the Shining Force and leave at once. Uh-oh. You defeated my pets, but you won't bother me anymore. You're going to burn. Oh, that's all right. Yeah. She sets the... Michela, I think is her name. Burn, K-Dog, burn. You'll serve as an, as, a, as an example to all who dare oppose Room Boss. Good riddance, insect. Okay, dog, run. The ship's going down. I love the blue Sega Genesis fire there. And there goes the ship. This is bad. That was the only ship in town. Maybe the mayor can help you again. That was the damn mayor. You owe me another ship, sir. What? They burnt your ship. Now we have no single ship in this town. The only other town with ships is Uranbatol. But it's a long way from here. Are you still determined to go? Well, yeah, oh yeah, I am. Uh, Uranbatol is very remote. It's far to the northeast. Go to Shade Abbey. Okay. Ask my son all the details for, about the journey, which his son, I think, is here. Head north to Shade Abbey. You shouldn't have much trouble finding it. Okay, yeah, because this gets opened up. Come all the way up here. This is Shade Abbey right here. Help! My name is Amon. Please save Valbaroy. He'll die unless you help. Okay. I don't think there's anything in here. Where, where am I? What am I doing here? I don't know, buddy. Now he's following you. It's even creepier. I'm so confused. I don't know what's real or what's in my imagination. Sorry, I can't talk on guard duty. Oh, okay. Snarl. the Shade Abbey. I'm rather busy right now. Please see me later. You're a priest, dude. You're not... Look at this. We got everybody following us. And now this lady just walked out of the way. Enjoy your visit, stranger. Now they're all following you. Run! It's a trap! And sure enough, here we are. Been praying, and well, you might. Dark Soul, you and your pitiful shining horse cannot be saved by prayers. You won't escape. How fitting that you perish in a form or chapel of light. I leave you now in the care of my minions. You know, undead dispose of these pests once and for all. So that's going to be our next part, guys. Next battle. And, uh, yeah. So we're going to have... Zombies, of course. A lot of zombies. Some skeletons. And a ghoul. So there we go, guys. That's going to be our next part. The Shade Abbey Chapel. So, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. And, as always, give this video a thumbs up, as it does help the channel grow. Love you guys.